Hello guys, Soft Tony here, welcome to another video lesson and in this tutorial we're going to unlock the magic of liquid transition. Join me in this tutorial as I explore captivating fluid motion effects, learn how to create stunning transition that seamlessly transforms solids and colors, adding elegance and dynamics to your videos. So without any further ado, let's jump straight in into After Effects and create this really really cool transition. Alright, we're here in After Effects and first like always let's create a new composition, hit Ctrl plus N or this little icon here for the composition name I will do. Final of course, you can type your own text, 9020 by 1080 full HD, 30 frames per second and duration 5 seconds long. Hit OK and now let's create our background, go right click, find here a solid layer, I will rename it to background, hit OK and now let's add our first effects. Go here in the effects and preset and if you can't find it, just go window and click here to find effects and preset and type ramp effect just drag and drop onto our background layer and now uh, it's time to make a few adjustments uh, grab this handle move it to the upper left side this one will be here on the right uh, bottom corner and now let's change our colors for this particular tutorial you can choose this blue color and you can also use eyedropper like this for the second one maybe brighter blue color uh, of course everything is up to you Hit OK and now let's import our first media in our scene, just drag and drop our media like so. I will scale it down because this is bigger than a full HD uh, comp, OK. Just move it down a bit if you need, like this. And now let's create our matte layer, go right click, find here again solid, I will rename it to matte and then hit OK. Now let's add our next effect, we will add a not so well known effect here in After Effects, CC Split 2, just do not uh, add this Split 1, add Split 2 because it's a better option for our today's tutorial and of course we will make uh, adjustments here on our Split 2 effect. Hit stop watch for point A, B and Split 1 and 2 and then hit you to show uh, all of our keyframes, go to around uh, 2 seconds, for the split type here 250, uh, we can do reverse animation, grab them, then go uh, keyframe assistance, time reverse, so our first keyframe will be 250 and our second one will be 0. Ok, now uh, for the point A and point B, um, grab this uh, point A, move it around here maybe, and for the point 2 go on the right side until you uh, can't see this matte option. Ok, now go uh, here to around 4 seconds and uh, grab this uh, first handle, move it a bit to the right and this one move it also a bit to the left. Now grab all of uh, our keyframes, hit F9 on your keyboard, go to graph editor, uh, draw a curve like this for this uh, split 1 and 2 and also draw the same curve for the point A and point B. And if you can't find uh, curves like this, just go uh, right click and click here, edit speed graph. Okay, our next step is to uh, find here track mats. If you can't find them, just hit here toggle switches and modes and grab this media 01 and find here alpha mat. Now, when we hit zero in our finals, we have this really basic and cool animation for now. Now let's add our next effect here on our uh, matte layer, go here on the facts and preset, find here turbulent displays, drag and drop onto our matte layer and now we can play around with the options. For the displacement you can choose from the various different options, for this particular tutorial maybe I will choose turbulent smoother, you can play around, for the amount you can also uh, find here uh, different numbers, find what is suitable for you, maybe 120 for the size maybe around 70 and now when we hit zero we have this type of animation. Now let's pre-compose this media and matte layer, grab them uh, all, then right click, pre-compose and I will just type here one. Hit OK and now it's time to duplicate this uh, one composition, uh, hit Ctrl plus D or go edit and then uh, duplicate, move this one 
maybe two or three frames ahead and then go here in the facts and preset find here fail effect drag and drop onto our uh, first layer and now when we hit zero as you can see we're getting this awesome liquid animation of course you can change colors in every moment find here maybe darker blue like this maybe to duplicate this one once again like so for this second one also add a fill effect maybe to change it to the an another type of blue like this and now when we hit zero we have this really cool and awesome liquid animation also if you uh, don't like the angle just go inside this um, uh, first composition hit here on our matte layer if you can find the effects control hit f3 on your keyboard okay and then uh, on our split effect hit also u here on our keyboard go to around our first keyframes for our point a and point b and move this uh, point a on the left side and the second one move here on the right upper side and now in our finals we have this really cool animation of course you can play around with the option to get your suitable result of course uh, turbulent displays you can change it also in every moment amount size and everything else also evolution and complexity everything is up to you in our finals now we have this really really cool and awesome animation all right guys this was really easy to create a tutorial this was cool transition hope you learned something new from today's tutorial so if you like this video please hit that like button uh, write me comment down in the comment section also take a look on my channel for even more great tutorials and until next time stay creative and bye bye